The 44-player mutual fund industry saw net outflows of 1.5 lakh crore in September as compared to net inflows of 1 lakh crore. Now, most of the debt schemes, particularly liquid funds, witnessed large outflows in September. Now, last month, credit risk funds did continue to suffer with massive outflows on the back, while on the other hand, equity funds saw inflows. Let's do a three-point analysis on each of these mutual fund categories. 1. Liquid funds see highest outflows. Liquid funds, which are used by banks and corporates to park surplus cash, recorded the highest number of outflows last month. The category registered an outflow of 1.4 lakh crore in September. Now, Amphi CEO Venkatesh believes that this is a quarterly phenomenon as companies and banks usually withdraw their investments from liquid funds to pay quarterly advance tax. 2. Credit risk funds continue to suffer. Credit risk funds continue to witness an outflows on the back of defaults and downgrades. Credit risk funds recorded outflows of 2,300 crores in September as against outflows of 2,200 crores in August. Now, the back-to-back -back downgrades of debt instruments from ILNFS, DHFL and Reliance Home Finance have, by uh, rating agencies have hurt credit risk funds. 3. Equity funds flows slowed. Inflows in equity funds including ELSS category fell from little over 9,000 crore to 6,600 crore in September. Now, fund managers attribute the slower inflows to volatile equity market last month.